proceed from the mouth of God. Amen. So let me just uh, let me just read that. What version is that? This is New King James version. Okay, so this is a New International version. Okay. Uh, as Minister Hepzibah, um laid out the um, the background, this was during the temptation of Jesus after he um, was hungry, he was uh, fasted Fasted. for forty days, forty nights. So Matthew four four, New International. Man shall not live bread by bread. Life. Yes. Uh, yes, yes it, uh, but he answered and said, "This was during the temptation of our Lord." With the devil uh, in the wilderness, it is written, "Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God." Amen. So let me just uh, let me just read that. What version is that? This is New King James version. Okay, so this is a New International version. Okay. Uh, as Minister Hepzibah um, laid out the um, the background, this was during the temptation of Jesus after he um, was hungry. He was uh, fasted for 40 days, 40 nights. So Matthew 4.4, 4, New International Version says, Then Jesus was led by the Spirit into the desert to be tempted by the devil. After fasting for 40 days and 40 nights, he was hungry. The tempter said to him, he came to Jesus and said, If you are the Son of God, turn these stones into bread. Mm -hmm. Jesus answered, It is written, Man does not live by bread alone, but on every word that proceeds from the mouth of God Almighty. Amen. So that tells me that even though Jesus Christ was hungry after being after fasting 40 days and 40 nights, mm -hmm. you know, um, well, it says a lot of things, you know, didn't want to succumb to the devil because that would have been it. That all our, the future of our salvation we'll rested on Jesus mm -hmm. resisting the devil. But... What did Jesus do? He turned to the word of God. Jesus himself says it is written. What is written? When he says it is written, he's talking about what was written, whether it's the scrolls or whatever it is. Today it's the Bible that we have, that I have in my hand. It says, Jesus says to the devil, it is written. Man shall not live by bread alone. So if Jesus needed the word of God to <laughs> to, to strengthen, strengthen himself, yes, to you know, to overcome that temptation, yeah. you know, so really how much more, more we need it. But also in addition to that, a, a second secondary point from there is that we need the word of God as food, as food yes. spiritual, food, spiritual food, to grow. Amen, amen. Powerful. Please carry and, on. And also, it says uh, that proceed out of the mouth of God. Yes. The more the, the Holy Spirit helps us to spend time in the Word of God, the Word of God begins to speak to us. Yes. So it becomes from just written word yes. to living word yes. because it begins to speak to you personally. Yes. So it's like from God's mouth to you yes. and to me. Yes. You proceed from God to me. Amen. This promise. So I can hold on to it. Yes. So God is always speaking in his word. Uh, there was a passage I was reading this uh, a yes. few days ago. And I said, oh my word, I've read this passage over and over again. Yes. I didn't say this word. Right. We're yes. in the book of Esther, or uh, passage in the book of Esther. I'm like, oh my word. Oh, thank you, Lord. This is just refreshing yes the word that came from the lord to me at that particular time wow so god want to speak to us Jesus through his word what you need. yes and spiritual food you know like it's almost like when you're hung you know like you, when you were speaking the holy spirit said food spiritual mm -hmm. food i know i just mentioned about yeah spiritual mm -hmm. food but you know you were saying that you needed something you were reading something is it in the book of esther, esther you said yeah. it just reminded me of like when you're really hungry you know, like you're famished and you actually need, you're hungry for food, you need substance, you yes. need nutrition, nu nu nutrients to keep you going. It just reminded me of that, that when you were saying that sometimes we need, the, we don't even realise how much we need, we need it sometimes. The times we just pick this up and maybe just open it. Sometimes I haven't got a clear plan it's when I'm words. having my mm -hmm. quiet time mm -hmm. and, I, and God knows what I need. I'm like, God, mm -hmm. show me something. Mm -hmm. I need a word from the mm -hmm. Lord. And I'll just open it at any page. And I'll sit there and I'll read it. And it's like, wow. Mm -hmm. This is, what I've got for this is really what I needed. Yes, amen. Because God wants to speak to us at every given time. And it yes. will help us as well to, to um, kind of judge what we're hearing. 
Yeah. Is it from the Lord? Yeah. Is it just your mindset or my mind or my heart that is just speaking? I want to check it with the Word of God. Yeah. So that I'm sure, okay, this is written in the Word of God. Yes. And this is what it actually means. Yes. Then I can use it for my life. And that's an important mm -hmm. point because mm -hmm. we so there's so much some some so many voices that we're hearing yes. these days yes. in this day and age mm -hmm. <laughs> in this digital mm -hmm. age. Yes. Everyone's an influencer. Yes. Everyone's a life coach. Yes. Everyone wants to speak so on it. Something. You know. And there's so many different sermons we're hearing, and so many you know, so many things or yes, speakers that say they use God mm -hmm. a lot. They use, but yet sometimes it doesn't add up. Sometimes it doesn't. You know, some all this speak your truth and mm -hmm, all this stuff. Mm -hmm, we mm -hmm. it's really important what you said about checking the word mm -hmm. of God. Mm -hmm. You know, making sure it balances out, making Together sure that is, what you're hearing is from the Lord. Is from the Lord. From because the Lord. there are so many messages and so mm -hmm. many different speeches that appear or sound good or look good. And it might be from the Lord. So we want to check it with the word. So the word of God keeps us in the position of um, uh, in the position yeah. that God wants us to be right direction the yes. right place uh, and the word of God give peace as well yes yeah. and it goes back to that scripture in Psalm 119 about mm -hmm. the word is a lamp yes. unto my feet uh, unto my light feet to my path. light to my path mm -hmm. you know yeah. what's a path it's a route isn't it or you guys say route <laughs> <laughs> R O U T E root. Yes, you know, it's a yeah, root. So yeah. it gives you the right on the road you are on the, the right road, mm -hmm. the right direction. Mm -hmm. Otherwise yes, you may you kind of lane. go off lane and yes, go off course and yes. go on the wrong, and on the the wrong, wrong direction yes. and end up with the wrong consequence, wrong result. Yes. That God never intended for yes, you. Yes, absolutely. Yes, it reminds us of who we are, yes, isn't amen. it? The devil would love us to keep this book closed. Yes, amen. You know, just That's keep true. it on the shelf, mm -hmm. dusty, and never Put open it. it. Pillow. Put it on the pillow, <laughs> on the, with Psalm 91. One that the pillow was meant for me to learn the word and live the word. Yes. Then years after I got born again. Yes. I thank God for that. But thank God. I know that it's not meant for... Uh, for me to sleep, sleep yeah. out, you know, but it's meant to be in my heart. I was told that as well. Mm -hmm. But it's interesting that, that mm -hmm. must be a, a Nigerian yeah. thing. <laughs> because I was told that too. <laughs> you know, put your Bible under your, your pillow. pillow. But yeah. with Psalm 91, you know. But as you said, it's not meant to be just under your pillow, no. you know. Even if you want to sleep with Psalm 91, open up the Bible and put it on your bed then. <laughs> but more important is your spirit man. More let it be, yeah, let it be your heart, let it be my heart. More so importantly, it, more it needs to be written yes. in the tablets of your heart. Yes, it's amen. so important. Amen. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. amen. So we're gonna look at a couple more scriptures and I think yes. that's that's more or less it. Obviously the topic, the word of God, the Bible, just like prayer. Yeah. We were able to do prayer in one session, but mm -hmm. We could have um, two, three, four, on the word of God. five or six separate parts, yes, you man. know, because the word of God is, is, is powerful. It's, it's, it's yes. just, we're just taking like the it, summary and of, of, of faith, just of over, it. overview. Yeah. Appreciate yourself, no matter what you have done in the past, yes. no matter the mistake we've made. Yes. Because we know the word of God, we can forgive ourselves. Yes. We can receive forgiveness from God Definitely. and be able to lift up your head and Walk as a child of the living God. Yes, forgiven. Yes. Forgiven. No guilt. There is therefore now no condemnation. No condemnation for those that are in, in Christ, Christ Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Amen. We we free from the word of God. We set free from yes. the word of God. Yes. Proverbs three, one to two. My son, forget not my law or my word, but let the heart keep my commandments. For length of days and long life. And peace shall they add to you. I kind of want to break it down some reading. Yeah. Not just to rush it. Yeah. It tells us, it said, let the word of God be in your heart. Don't forget. Yes. Yeah, this is Solomon talking to his son. Yeah. Don't forget the word. Let it be in your heart. Keep it. Obey the word of yes. God. Yes. Like what was saying earlier. So leave the word of God. Yeah, leave it out. Leave it out. It's because you obey the word. Yes. Because the word of God is wisdom. 
It's wisdom. This is wisdom. He protects us. Yes. And then help us to live a long life. Yes. You amen. Know? And also, because the word of God is life, he helps us to live a long life and live in peace as well. Yes. For example, if you like eating something sugary, which I used to really like, something sugary, because it's the word of God, yes. God tell you, no, yes. stop that. Stop eating like this. Stop doing this. Yes. All this things is to give you long life. Yes. It's not because it's wisdom. Yeah, it, and that's what it says yes. in that scripture you just read. You know, you said it's Solomon talking to David, it's yeah? To his son. Yeah, to his son. To his son, David. one of his sons. Oh, one of his sons. Yeah, son. It says, yeah. my son. But we can also see it mm -hmm. as God talking to, to us. us. yes. You know, my son, yes. and as I like to add, yes. my daughter too. Yes. My son, my daughter, mm -hmm. forget not my law, yes. but let thine heart keep my commandments. Mm -hmm. Sorry, this is King James, so that's why yeah. you've got the V and now it's the line. <laughs> <laughs> the Shakespearean, William yes. Shakespeare, you know. So, but as you said, you know, look at verse look at the two. Benefit, the benefit. The Proverbs chapter, um, Proverbs three, verse, verse two, two says, yes. "For the length of days." Yes, as you said, days. you know, direction. like direction, wisdom. Yes. wisdom that you were a, a, someone that ate lots of sugar, yes, and, and we know it's not good for or us anymore. Or you want to travel, and or you also to, don't go. Yes, it's wisdom. Instruction, yes, wisdom, wisdom. It protects. He come to protect us so that we can live a long life. Yes, and it says, and yes, peace and shall peace. add to thee. Yes. You know, but but let's let's this is really serious because yes. it's like one of the promises, isn't it? It's yes. like it's one of the not so much promise but a condition. So she like I always used to, you know, we have to know these things. There's one other uh, promise. I think it was the first instruction that came with a promise. This was like when I had young children and bonus children. That never wanted to listen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and I say, look, the Bible says, yes. obey your parents so it yes. may you may live long. Long, yes. yes, and may be well with you. And may be well with yes. you. Yes, amen. So amen. this is amen. like amen. this is another one, yes. isn't it? Yes. Another one that's equally important that comes with a condition. Mm -hmm. You know, listen to my my law, my word. My yes. word. You know, mm -hmm. keep my commandments. Keep try and follow this with the aiding of the prompting of the Holy Spirit and the Amen. grace of God. Amen. Yes. You know, try put this into practice. Yes. Don't forget this. Mm -hmm. This is important. These are my words. Yes. You know, and when you do that, your days will be long. Mm -hmm. You know, it comes with a condition. condition. For length of your days and long life and peace will shall you. they add Amen. to you. Amen. Also, Proverbs 4, 20, verse 22. Yes. Um, it says, um, King James's version says, my son is similar to the previous the one. Yeah, yeah, the previous mm -hmm. um, scripture, Proverbs chapter 3. But yeah, Proverbs chapter 4, verse 20 to 22 says, my son attends, my son, my daughter, attend to my words. Amen. Incline thine ear unto my sayings. Let them not depart from thine eyes. Keep them in the midst of thine heart, Amen. for they are life unto those that find them, and health to, to all their flesh. Amen. I think another version said health to your bones, isn't yes. it? So witness the word of God, as we take the word of God in, it brings healing to yes. us. Yes. begin to heal every part of us. Yes, that's right. Jesus said to... Um, to Peter when he wanted to watch his feet and Peter said, Okay, no, no, no it's okay if I don't watch you no part of me. He said, Okay, watch yeah. every part of me. Yeah. He said, No, he said the word that you have heard. It's it cleansed yes. you. Yes. So the word cleanses us. Amen. You have to believe it. Lord, as I'm reading your word, yes. I ask that you just let it cleanse everything that is Amen. not of you or of my mind, yes. of my heart, of my body. Bring me healing, and the word of God does that. It yes. begins to bring healing and deliverance. Back. Amen. Because it's powerful. Yes. yes. The word of God is powerful. Because they're not just ordinary words. When no. you think about it's John chapter God. one, the yes. word of God, the word was God, the word mm -hmm. was with God. Mm -hmm. The words are God, more or less God Himself. Yes. You know. Yes. So yeah. You know, and 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 so why? Somebody asks you, why do we need to be reading the Bible and why is it relevant or what do we need it for? I think this part of what we're saying, the benefit to your health. Yes. You need it yes. to your health. You need it for long life. Yes. You need it to be able to trust God 
because once we know the word, we can trust him. He is the word. He, he gave us the word. Yes. It, as we know the word more and more every day, we trust him more. Yes. And more. We relax more and more in his presence. Amen. You know, so the word of God is powerful. It protects us. It's light to our path. Yes. So we don't walk in darkness. Yes. So if we walk in darkness, we will fall. Yes. You yeah, because we can't see our can't way. See. <laughs> you know, we'll but stumble and we'll fall. Yes. And there might be pits and pitfalls and you know some Around stuff in, the, in the world and we because we can't see mm -hmm. we'll accidentally fall inside fall into it. and it would have got give peace yes yes he said let your heart not be troubled yes so john 14 yes he yes. come to give us peace my peace i live with him yes so his peace his word is yes so whenever he give us his word is to say rest in my word. yes don't worry about what's going on yeah just trust me and also yeah. for maybe sort of baby Christians or mm -hmm. people that are considering or maybe people that don't have a relationship with God, I always explain it like this. God made us in simple terms. He might, just like when you buy a product, you know, whether it's a new washing machine or a camera. <laughs> <laughs> camera we're using to record this broadcast. Yes. You know, you really look at the instruction manual, especially yes, if there's so. something goes wrong. Mm -hmm. Most of the time we just open the package and, and the parcel and we just <laughs> plug it in and we don't even, they always say read, read the information before yeah. you use it, but we don't. We always wait until, and then, you know, similarly. Sometimes when it's poor. Yeah, <laughs> when it's broken or you know not functioning that's mm -hmm. when we open them the the instruction the information yeah. but also that goes that just came to mind thank you holy spirit Amen. but also that's what some people do they don't take time to read to find out how god is what he's all about to build a relationship with him is when things are dire d-i-r-e yeah. when things are really the drastic yes. they're in the word word a very very bad place mm -hmm. that's when they start praying oh god Where i've just been oh, my enemy's just been diagnosed with cancer god i need you oh lord jesus 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 god that's when they start praying when mm -hmm. things are bad mm -hmm. but i was actually going to say yes okay so that's a side note but also i was saying that God made us. He manufactured, you know, just like a product, mm -hmm. I would say. But God is our creator. He is our heavenly, eternal Father, Father that Amen. spoke life, gave it's us God. life, gave us flesh and it's bones God. and spirit and, and soul yes. and, and put us together as yes, in the book of Genesis. Amen. So he knows best yes, he does. how we should operate. Yes. He knows best how we should function. Amen. Do you, un you, you understand? I so do, that's my that's my simple explanation. Yes. If someone says well, this Bible thing, why mm -hmm. do we need it? Because this is God's instruction. As, yes. as we started the acronym, for, yes. for everyday living, it's mm -hmm. basic information, mm -hmm. basic instruction, basic um, um, inst information for, information for, for us living every day. Like that will be beneficial to us. You know, because God mm -hmm. made us. We are made in his, in his image. image. Yes, and we are his nest. children. Mm -hmm. He is our father. Yes, Lord. So he knows, just like us Everything. parents. Yes. We teach our children. We know we've been there. We 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 we, we tell them don't do this or yeah, don't do, do that. that you know, don't put your experience. because of what we've experienced. Yes. You know, don't Definitely. put your hand on the fire, the stove mm -hmm. is hot. Yes. And then when our get burnt. you get burnt. And then when our back is turned, they put it's their hand right. and, and then it's like Ow! you know, so there's consequences. Yeah. So God does that. Like a father, mm -hmm. he made us, he created us. Everything. So yes. he knows how best we need to he knows what's best for us yes. and he writes what's best for us in the word, His word of, of God. God. The Bible gives us uh, direction. It gives us exactly the heart of God. Yes. God is trying to say to us, this is who I am. And this is who I want you to be. Yeah. So, so yeah, we've had a great discussion on Very the good discussion, God. yes. So to conclude, you've got um, the book of Josh Joshua, Joshua chapter 1 verse 8. Okay. So um, let me read it out. Yes. This book of the law shall not depart from your mouth. But you shall meditate on it day and night, that you may observe to do according to all that is written in it. For then you will make your way prosperous, and then you will have good success. Amen. 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 So the word of God make us successful as we live it, as we obey it, as we 
ask the Holy Spirit to help us live the Word of God, then we become successful Amen. in all areas of our life. Wow. With our relationship with God, yes. our relationship with our families and friends, yes. with our health, every area, every career. aspect of life. Yes. Wow. The more we believe the Word of God and trust it. It's medicine, isn't it? Yes. It's almost like when someone is ill and they take medication, medication. they take medicine. Yes. So the Word of God is our medication. It's our medicine, yes. It makes, it helps us to get well. It helps us to get well. It helps us to think right. Yeah. So we have a right mind. You see, we have the mind of Christ. Then we we'll begin to have the mind of Christ. Amen. It helps yes. us, as you mentioned before, throughout this broadcast, peace. And peace. then you just mentioned about success. Yes, that's right. So it's important. I'll conclude with Deuteronomy chapter 6. Amen. And, uh, I love the scripture because yes. I've always looked at, and there's also I think Deuteronomy 11, but it more or less says the same thing. Um, I'm going to read Deuteronomy chapter 6 from verse 5 to, uh, to 9. So, I'll probably cut that. So, Deuteron so I'll read, um, so to conclude, I'll yes. read. Deuteronomy chapter 6 from verse 5 wow. to 9. Okay. I love this scripture yes. because it shows yes. me how intentional God wants us to be Amen. concerning the word Lord of God. God. Okay, so Deuteronomy 6 from verse 5, um, reading from the New International Version, it says, Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength, from verse 6. It says, these commandments that I give you today are to be upon your hearts. Amen. Impress them on your children. Mm. Talk about them when you walk along the road. Wow. When you lie down and when you get up. Tie them as symbols on your hands and bind them on your foreheads. Write them on the door frames of your houses and on your gates. Elsewhere in Deuteronomy, it says, write them on the tablets of your heart. Yes. So yes. that's how the word of God is, word of God is really yes. important. Yes. God, it's not just one place he mentions. He says, even when you're walking along the road with your children, talk about, talk about them. Talk you know, just like how we talk about, oh, mm -hmm. the weather's nice, oh, yeah. it's sunny, oh, it's there's clouds mm -hmm. in the oh, sky. There's political issues or this current affairs. Yeah, current affairs. Yes. We could talk about yeah. the political yeah. issue, the yeah. injustices, yeah. the racial divide, the, all the stuff, police issues and the, right. the protests. Else. But... We should yeah. talk about the word of God. We need to talk love. about the word of, God. word of God. Yes, word of God is more powerful. It changes all and it things. changes things, yes. isn't it? it we can all pass things. laws about this change, change police all. reform and all these kind change of things and things. the protests and and these things are really important. But the, the word, word of God, of God is is powerful. God Himself, isn't it's it? Powerful. So God is yeah. the ruler. Oh. He is He is oh, Majesty. Oh. So He's able to change circumstances. Yes change these things and he said because when you talk about the word of god when you lie down when you yes. walk on the way you and the word begins to engrave more and more in your into heart your and into your mind yes and we can keep it and to the point where it becomes natural yes to live it you, it's not yeah. like oh you have to kind of stress oh mm -hmm. i have to mm -hmm. get into this bible and yeah. understand it and you know, I have to take time out. It's not, you don't do it begrud um, begrudgingly mm -hmm. because it's, as you said, way of life. You're yes. talking about it on the All street, the time, you know, with your children, when At you home, sit down, when you lie, lie down. down. So to put them on your door frames. Yeah. Reminds me of, uh, you know, the Passover when the blood of the, um, of the lamb, of the lamb mm -hmm. when um, Pharaoh wanted to kill the firstborn of, of, the, of, the, of the, the sons, of the yeah. Israelites eldest sons and you know God says put the, the blood of the lamb on the doorpost and yeah. it says the same thing about the word of God so yeah, it's almost like when God a protection going to, going to protect get them out of yes. Egypt, yeah, Egypt trying to get them out of the bondage one of uh, the, Israel, the, 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 the angel yes. of death was going to go around the nation. Okay, yes, yeah, sorry, I got yes. it mixed up. Yes. It's not, it's yes. not when uh, they Jesus, killed it. yeah, yeah. It's mm -hmm. God was put in the place, yes. so you know, to teach to. Pharaoh a, a, a lesson that, Amen. you know, when you when I tell you, let my people go, let them go, you let them go, let don't them wait go. for me to, to you know, come, to come after you with, mm -hmm. with heavy judgment. So, mm -hmm. yes, so, yeah, so the lamb, of, the lamb, uh, the blood of the lamb yes. that was on the door. 
doorpost is synonymous with the word, yeah, of, God, the word of God because yes. God says in his word that we need to um, bind it on our doorposts mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. keeps us safe it's keeps our protection with all God all the time yeah yes and and you, today you don't we don't have to bind it on our head you say it would be written on our hearts. Written on our hearts, yes. 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 So we can live it yes. from within. You live yes. it from within. So obviously, mm -hmm. you know, I read that scripture like, but I'm, I'm just using that to yes. show how intentional God wants us to make every effort not to forget yes. his yes. word. Why I said that? Because sometimes if, if yes. you're someone that is just a young Christian, <laughs> I say, oh my word, I have to bind it in my heart. <laughs> a, my, in my, in my on head. your forehead. My forehead. Or put it on your doorpost. Yes, yes, yes. of course. Yes. Yes. yes, so that's why I just kind to of clarify, that, so yes. I we don't run to that. Yes. But the truth is what you said. Yes. Yes. God is intentional. Yes. Everything he said to us yes. in this word of God. He wants it's us to be serious. He's it's serious about it. It's he doesn't want us to just, you know, forget his words. Those yes. scriptures in Proverbs, my son, my daughter, do yes. not forget my words. Mm -hmm. We need mm -hmm. this word. Yes. It's life, Amen. it's power, it's success, it's Amen. peace, it's protection, it's food, it's yes. all those things. Yes, but you know what? Thank We've you. run out of time. Yes, <laughs> thank you so much. This is this, is, this was a blessing. Amen. I'm blessed. I'm no, really, I'm really blessed. blessed. I'm blessed I'm with really your blessed. presence. Thank oh, you for joining thank me, you Minister so much. Uh, Viewers, if they want to interact with you, I know you have your her Instagram channel. Her Instagram is called Learning with Z. Yes. That's Z E E or yes. Z E E. Uh, what's yes. your YouTube channel? My YouTube channel is Word for Word Talk. Word for Word. Word, word. For word number four. Word okay. for Word Talk. Word W O R D. Yeah. Number four and W O R D talk. Yes. Oh, that's a nice Amen. catchy uh, <laughs> channel name. How did Thank I get you. that? <laughs> and mine is Dawn Majesty. Please Amen. don't forget to subscribe. Yes, Until yes. next time, I'll catch you later. Cheers. Bye, Bye for bye. now. Bye bye.